Hey guys, what's up? Vero here, back with a play with me video. I originally thought about not doing one today, um, so this is probably getting posted Tuesday morning, but I'm filming it Monday night. I just didn't really feel like filming any videos today, so I kind of just chilled and ran errands and stuff. But I wanted to show my old planner that I'm going from, and now I'm going into the new life planner for the new binder system that Erin Condren has. Spoiler, I absolutely love it. Um, my only complaint is it's really hard to open and it's really hard to actually close it itself because of the way that the paper sit in the actual binder. Um, if you want to see a full review of like my first impressions of the binder system, I'll link the video down below. But I really love being able to take the pages out. It made planning so much easier like oh my goodness but this week we're using this adorable stranger things kit i don't know if adorable is the word i would use <laughs> from glam planner i think this was the essentials version absolutely love it um because it starts on july 4th series comes back and i originally was going to use a fourth of july type kit but i wanted to use this instead so i ne never ended up getting a fourth of july kit just got this instead but this is my first time planning in the binder. I never did any test ones because I wanted to just figure it out on the fly. And so you guys will see how I kind of figured out how to uh, do things in it. I do put this dinner thing down and I decided to take it out later. So you'll, uh, you'll see that here in a bit. I did have to kind of relearn how to film planner videos just because it's such a different thing to just have papers in front of you like I don't know how to explain it like as you can see I'm kind of out of frame a lot so I do adjust the camera here in a second so hopefully that won't be an issue again but oh it's so much easier to use the binder it'll definitely be interesting to figure out like how to use different things and what works in it and what doesn't work in it and what kits I like how it looks and what kits I don't like in it or you know whatever um and then here I decided to use the checklist that can come in the kit instead of using the big box ones because I figured the big box ones like the full box checklist I can always use for another day or another week rather whereas these ones I don't know since they're seven and they all look the same I thought it would look cuter to just use that and I just use them in the same color order and then just added the today headers right underneath and then added the full box sticker that comes with the kit because I just think it's really cute and I wanted to use it. And I work on the weekends, so I don't usually have too much going on besides work and then streaming right after, so it's not a huge big deal for that to be all covered. And I can always add stuff on top of it if if I need to. But I basically decided to plan my usual way. This is when I take the dinner sticker up um, and do, you know, today, or to do, sorry, and then checklist, and then today's, and then full boxes, and then little things at the bottom, and washi, and half boxes and stuff and then I put this stuff on the side and then I wanted to put one of the checklists which I did use some of them that came with the kit I just didn't use all of them so here I'm trying to find if I have any to-do stickers that match so I have a bunch of glam planner stuff from like glitch kits and stuff like that or um like glitch mystery packages I don't know or just um I forget what they're called but or you just order like a surprise thing <laughs> And they send them um, but I found this to do sticker that's like a, a grayish color from uh, a planner shop that I'm suddenly blanking on the name on it's like on the tip of my tongue I know it's SP but for some reason I can't think of the name but I decided to use that um, because it matched for the most part because all the other colors I was finding was like pink and stuff and then here I'm using undo to get the sticker up because I didn't like how it placed and I'm not trying to be a perfectionist with it but I just didn't like how it looked and I want it to at least be it doesn't have to be perfectly straight but I want it to be at least a little close like that one didn't go down perfectly but it's close enough for me and then here I'm just filling out the little things and then putting them down and I do write IG because one's for Instagram and one's for YouTube although the YouTube video might be going up Tuesday since right now it is 10 30 at night and I don't know if I want to put up this late um, and then I want to do some reading on Tuesday because Monday and Tuesday are my days off from work and then just putting down the sticker back down after you use undo you have to wait a few minutes for the sticker to be uh, like a sticker again to be tacky again and then you can put it back down uh, and then just looking through the kit and so I decided to first use these half boxes and then a quarter box 
but I didn't like how it looked, so I took it up and then I basically made it match the checklist at the top. And then when I got to Friday, I realized that I didn't have one that matched, so I just had to use a quarter box anyway, because I wasn't going to put them on Saturday and Sunday. So that was kind of annoying, but whatever. And then I decided to zoom you guys in since you can see a little bit better. I'm sorry for my camera shaking. It is on this uh, like mic stand thing that's attached to my desk, that's why it shakes a little bit. I started writing on the paper and I flipped it over to see if it bled through. It did not, I was happy, but uh, Monday, since I, like I said, I filmed this on Monday, I was able to pretty much fill out Monday entirely because, you know, the day already happened for the most part. Um, and then just putting a bill due sticker because I have my cell phone bill due on the, it's actually due on the 11th, but I usually, since I get paid on Friday, I'm gonna go ahead and pay it. Um, and then I put the little Ghostbuster sticker to cover that little thing at the top because I didn't like how, I, I don't know, I just don't like it. It just it looks random, I guess. So I thought I would put that there. And then I wrote that I want to tidy up, or that I did tidy up. Since, again, day off, so I like to do some cleaning and stuff. So Publix, tidy up, edit my plan with me, which I'm doing right now, whoop whoop. Um, I already go ahead and mark it off, and then I found these stickers in the actual kit, so I put it on the YouTube and the IG. And then put planning, pre-planning, plan, plan next week, whatever, on Thursday, because I'll probably do it before the weekend's over. And then I wrote my work schedule down. It's always the same, it's 12 to 8.30. I realized afterwards I should have put it lower, because I usually do stuff before work, like all meal prep, you know, like my breakfast is, breakfast is breakfast. <laughs> for like the next couple of days or I'll like tidy up, I'll work out, I'll do some cleaning, maybe I'll go run a quick errand and for some reason I just didn't think of that and I just wrote it at the very beginning. But that's okay. We'll we'll put at the stuff that we're doing that day on behind, uh, below it. I can't talk, I'm sorry. <laughs> and then now I'm going through my stash of stickers that I typically use for the week and doing a clean nude brushes from Planning Roses because I try to clean my makeup brushes at least once a week, but I try at least do two. And I thought we'd play some Nintendo Switch tomorrow, so I put that sticker from Fox and Cactus that I think is adorable, as well as the one on Stranger Things from Fox and Cactus, but I'm gonna play some more Zelda and Pokemon because I haven't really played it in a while. And then I'm down another pound, so I've lost about 20 pounds in total. And that sticker is from Planning Roses, so I put that down to mark that, and then the camera icon is from Dizzy Daisy Dreams, because I filmed a play with me, and then I'm filling out Tuesday since it's tomorrow, so I kind of know mostly what I'm doing. I tried finding another pen to use, because I don't like how this one writes on the actual paper personally, uh, but I couldn't find the one that I wanted, so that's fine. But that is pretty much the plan with me. I'm really happy with how it turned out. Here I am putting it back in the planner. I did have some trouble getting that page in, the bottom one didn't really fit where the hole was, um, so I kind of had to pull it a little bit. I was a little afraid to pull it, I was going to break it, but I didn't. But so far I really like the new binder. Um, we'll definitely see. I haven't been as into planning as the last few months as I have been in the past, but we're slowly trying to get back into it. I enjoy filming the plan with me's and doing this aspect. I'm just really bad about keeping up with the planner all week. So I'm trying to get better, but thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you haven't already, and subscribe if you haven't done that already. I put a new plan with me's typically every Monday, but sometimes on Tuesday, and I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!